ThingStream is a company that builds connectivity platforms for the Internet of Things, a network that runs across existing 2G, 3G and 4G cellular networks across the world. We have relationships with at least three carriers in every country, but often in more developed markets it may be five or six. We're about small amounts of data being sent reasonably frequently, bi-directionally. We have a lot of customers in things like asset tracking, containers that are moving between countries, maybe across the ocean as well. And they're tracking not just position, but often things like vibration monitoring, temperature, humidity, because they're offering their customers the ability to transfer goods and they can guarantee the environment in that process. When we were thinking about how to get data from Internet of Things devices into the enterprise to make that data useful, it seemed an obvious choice to get in touch with TIBCO. And the, we found the relationship has been great. There's always a trade-off with the, the complexity of a solution and what you can do on a device versus the battery life that you can achieve from it. You really want something that will compile down into something that's small and efficient, but at the same time be platform independent, and that's really the goals of Flogo. We've designed our solution to be as low power as it can possibly be. We have a demonstration to explain how ThingStream works with both Flogo and Tibco Cloud Messaging. We have Flogo running on a, on a piece of hardware, a Raspberry Pi device. We've got our, a cellular modem attached to that. We've got one of our ThingStream SIMs in that device. Then we have a component in our server-side platform that allows you to build essentially drag and drop integration and data processing. And one of those elements we have is a connector for Tibco Cloud Messaging. So you simply fill in your credentials into your Tibco Cloud Messaging account and we're publishing that data into, into Tibco Cloud Messaging. We have two flows, essentially. One of them that is looking for messages coming inbound and another one every minute or so is sending outbound messages. We're picking up sensor data, temperature, humidity, position, and sending that upstream back into the enterprise over the ThingStream platform. The Tibco engineers have built a solution that takes that data and then visualizes it in a dashboard. So you can see where devices are, you can then control whether you want to see temperature data or not by sending a message outbound. And that messaging on the way back out actually uh, uses MQTT. So another part of the Tibco components is direct integration with MQTT. It's a really nice solution. It allows projects to come to market instead of in 18 months, six months.